Guys, welcome back to the channel. John here. I uh, just wanted to let do a quick cargo buckle strap install on Big Red. Uh, these are cargo buckles. Basically, they work with any roof rack out there. Uh, if you hear a lot of noise in the background, they were just cutting his grass. So, let's get this party started. All you really need for this is you'll need a drill, center punch, some drill bits. It even says use a 7 16 but uh, we're going to probably start with 3 8 and wheel it out from that. And then some wrenches to uh, actually tighten everything down. But this should be a quick and easy project. So let's go and get started. Serious buckles there, guys. So depending on what size your rack is, this one should be a two inch. Should go right on there. So just like that. Moves around a little bit. Let's see if there's a thinner one. I think that's the thinnest right there. That's for a one and three quarter inch rack. Let's see what this is. Yeah, I think we're gonna go with a two inch rack like such. I think that'll turn out pretty well. So we will mark it and mount it. And then we'll be able to strap our gear down when we go places. You could use this for canoe kayaks. In my case, I'll mostly use it for lumber or whatever else I want to haul. So with that being said, let's get to marking, drilling, and installing. Right now is the perfect time. If you would, if you like this video, just give me a solid, give me a thumbs up. Smash that like button, smash that subscribe button, and keep coming back for more. Once again, you guys get to see me live my dream. The true purpose of this channel is to motivate you to get out there and start building your dream going to do is stick this up here. Make sure we got a good profile with a rack. Take from the center of our holes. So we got a good profile. There it goes. There it goes. All right. There's those two on the outside. So from here I just continued around the outside of the truck using the center punch to mark the holes. Then we'll come back, we'll pre-drill them with a small drill bit and then drill them out with a 3 8 drill bit. Alright, those look pretty good. Now we're just gonna step over. <laughs> we're gonna step over and mark the insides. So we got that. Got that how we want it. Got that one how we want. It says we're supposed to drill from both sides. Use one with a little bit of meat, so we'll go with the 1164. Okay. 
So now we've done all that, we're going to go through with the 3 8 See what that looks like on our first hole here. We're going to want to take and uh, do this thing real fast. Side. Let's do it from the inside now. Woo wee, those chunks of metal are hot. So make sure you guys wear some safety glasses. And all we're gonna do is clean the hole. So it doesn't look like the kick comes with any washers. This comes with some lock nuts. So what we're gonna do, put our buckle up here. We're gonna bolt through. Yeah, so that 3 8 works perfect. Yeah, no need to for the 7 16 I guess if you need some extra play in there, but this thing's got plenty of play. So. Yep, there you go, and that's all you do. You snug it down and you're good to go. There's that one. There's that one. And so when you go to strap your stuff down, all you do Pull this up, release it, wrap around your load, lock it in, pull that down. There, your load's strapped down. So that's a pretty cool little feature, guys. So now all we're gonna do is Zip this thing down with some wrenches, and I bet I guarantee you that's a half inch bolt. No, well, must be 9 sixteenths or 14 mil. 14 mil works. So we'll have to get another 14 millimeter wrench, keep the other side from turning. I mean, there will be some play in there. That thing's going to look good. Only other upgrade we're going to do is once we get our light lamps, we'll put some lights in here.
Alright, so that concludes the installation of the cargo buckle system. Uh, start to finish took me about 40 minutes total, 30 to 40 minutes. Thanks for watching today's video. I hope you guys enjoyed us installing the cargo buckle uh, contractor rack installation kit. They're about $100 for each one for both sides of racks, $200. As thanks for watching today's video. If you would, make sure you do me a solid. Smash that like button, smash that subscribe button, and keep coming back for more. Once again, you guys get to join me on the ride. See me living my dream. Other than this channel, know that you go out there and start building your dreams.